Hello everyone. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to clean uh, MacBook Pro fans. Uh, recently bought this MacBook and um, I've been hearing a lot of fan noise and um, I decided to give it a good clean. Uh, this is 2015 MacBook Pro 15 inch. Um, so what you need for this is one of the screwdrivers. It needs to be Pentelope I believe that's what the name is, number five. So you can get one of these sets, um, Amazon, eBay. Uh, I believe they cost like $10. So you can just buy specific ones for just the MacBook. I think they're five, six dollars. Um, there's a few different kinds. I actually have two. I used to clean um, a lot of MacBooks, open them up, change batteries, hard drive, um, and so on and so on. So basically you need uh, this, so you need a screwdriver, then you need one of those air, air cans, like um, dusters, whatever they're called. Uh, and then the next thing you probably need is some alcohol swabs. Um, I use this once, like um, uh, alcohol prep pads, or you can use just um, some swabs, or anything with alcohol, or just, you can use just uh, some tissue and some alcohol rubbing alcohol so what you're gonna do is of course turn it off and then you're gonna flip it you're gonna make sure this side is on this and then as you can see on the back there's a bunch of screws um, there's ten of them three on this side and you have two three on this side so ten um, so we're gonna just start by opening that opening them up I'm not gonna you know it's I'm not gonna go through each one on the video just to speed up some time but they're very easy to open there we go oh yeah you can see all this look at all this dust um yeah it's definitely this one have was never open so we're definitely gonna give it a good scrub let's check out the fans let's see Oh yeah, the fans look very dusty. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab uh, um, the duster can, or a can. And uh, I'm just gonna do the fan first. Oh, you can see, gosh, you can see all the dust. And we'll do the same. Let me show you guys on camera. It's hard to do it with, with one hand, but. You guys want to see how the dust just comes out. Look at all that. You can definitely see how much cleaner it is. And then just do, do it a little bit everywhere. can definitely see like all the dust getting out of it out of the fans it doesn't look as dirty as I thought it would be but it's only 2015 I experienced some very very dirty ones And also make sure you guys stay tuned at the end of the video I'm gonna show you which um, program I used for fan control in case this doesn't work um, I'm gonna show you guys um, the app that I uh, use to control the fan speed that's like um, and then you can also see the temperature of the um, temperature of the sensors um, CPU, GPU if you have one. This one has a separate um, GPU also. So yeah, make sure you give it a good scrub everywhere. You can see the corners are very dirty. Yeah, you guys can see all that dirt. Alright, once you finish all that and you feel like you clean that good, 
I think I'd clean and good except a little bit better is dusty, but you can give it a little bit of a, a little bit of a clean wherever you see some dirt. But pretty much this is very clean now. I think the fans are very clean. I'll give it just one more um, one more time. There we go. Now you just now you just put the bag back on and that's about it and put the screws in and then then I'll turn it on and and then I'll show you guys the app and we'll see how the fans are doing. Make sure you press on it a little bit so it sits in place before you start putting in the screws back on. The way I do it, I do one here and then I do one in the corner and then I do it a little bit diag diagonally. Um, there we go. Once we finish that, then we're just gonna start that up and see the, see how it performs. All right, so we got it. Um, we got it started, and this is the app I was telling you guys. Um, it's called uh, Max Fan Control. Um, and you guys see here. Let me zoom in a little bit. Uh, as you guys can see, it, it it's telling us the RPMs of the fans. So you have left and the right one. Right now it's at uh, twenty three to twenty five hundred, which is good. Um, once it goes anywhere around four to five thousand, it becomes very very noisy. And on the left side, you guys can see the uh, CPU average um, temperature. Um, if if it's anywhere between fifty and sixty degrees Celsius, that's good. Uh, if it goes over sixty, then it's it's running hot. Um, and also, um, as I mentioned, if you guys keep hearing loud fans and cleaning it doesn't work, you can change the, uh, you can change it to um, auto or you can do custom. So if you do custom, it's gonna tell you how many RPMs you want it to run at. Um, so you can change it to about 2,500 RPMs. It's gonna decrease the fan noise, so it's not gonna bother you. But at the same time, keep an eye on the CPU um cpu temperature um anywhere like mine is right now it's 48 but it's not doing anything so for example if i was running iMovie or even playing a game the cpu uh temperature would, would go up a lot um so yeah make sure you guys get this um get this app um especially if you have fan fan noise problems. Um, so what you're gonna do is just, uh, it's called uh, Max Fan Control. So basically you're just gonna go on a um, browser and just type Max uh, Fan, hold on. I just got this MacBook, so I'm still getting used to typing. Control, download. And then literally the first thing that pops up, it's the, uh, it's called crystally, no, crystalidea.com. So you're just gonna press that and then you're just gonna do free download. Um, that's about it, uh, it's pretty simple. It's a very, very easy to use app. It's just gonna stay in your browser and that's about it. Um, thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you have any questions, but uh, this video is definitely for people who are having fan problems like I did. Right now, it's not giving me any fan noise. 
um, because I'm I'm not doing anything. It's literally just uh, just started it up. But when I bought it, when I was doing updates, it was extremely extremely loud. Maybe that's why. But it doesn't hurt to have this app. Um, so all right, thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and thank you.